while for others, the movement is simply too awkward to feel natural. The rollover, I'll be honest, the rollover seems weird. Like, this seems like some ego shit. I feel like if you're making your dog do this, you have a higher propensity to, like, I don't know, murder kids or, like, keep heads, severed heads in your refrigerator. Like, this, this is weird. Learn to holding a treat in your See, that's and weird. Uh, to reward your dog body what, man? Depression. Yes, oh. good girl! Good girl! Oh. Yay! And then she hits the jackpot. Okay, okay. I do not like that. I'll die on this hill, man. I'm I like I like high fives. You know, I don't want I don't want my pet to be like inferior to me, man. No, it's not being dog racist. It's just like get on the fucking ground for daddy and roll over and maybe I'll give you something to eat. It's like I don't want that relationship with my dog. I want to go for a walk, uh, play fetch, chill out, lay around by the pool. I don't need that out of a fucking animal. Like, I want companionship and loyalty. I don't want some, want some weird fucking, like, get on your little leash for me and bow down. I'm your master. Whoa! All right, boys, let's hit it. <sighs> Caffeinated apple pie is, is a, a sentence I never thought I would hear in my life. That sounds horrible. This is tube food used by U2 spy <laughs> oh. plane pilots. We got caffeinated apple pie, polenta <laughs> oh, with cheese and bacon. I don't know about this, man. Beef stew. Each one weighs approximately five ounces or 141 grams, give or take a few. The tube is non-magnetic. Hey, princess, thank you so much. Yummer. Thank you for containers. a year and have been produced for over 50 years Battle buddy, are these now, good, man? With about have you had these before? Tubes made annually. That's just enough for the 100 or so active pilots Oof. that are using them. Oh, there's only 100 active pilots using it? Let's get this out onto a tray. Nice. Woo! Okay, let's first start off by checking out that caffeinated apple pie. Contains 100 milligrams of caffeine. That is such a crazy oh, idea. Use if tube is I've never tried these, uh, but I've seen planes before. It's crazy. Oh, you've seen the planes before. Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Swollen. When when would you use these? Just like on long Swollen. haul yeah. trips or something? It's okay. Tubed like, March 30th, What's keeping you from just eating normal food in a plane? Straw. Check this out. Specially threaded for these tubes. The feeding straw will connect to their helmet. Oh, U2 is a long they distance spy plane. Oh, cool. It protects them at altitudes of <clears throat> 60 to 70,000 feet. Or the oh, okay. I get it. Okay, okay, okay. 60 to 70,000 feet. Holy shit. So they actually wear spacesuits up there? Not boiling up. Nice. Makes them look like a astronaut. That's crazy. Yellow suits. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I thought it was the U2, like, private jet nice plane. Hiss. Nice little hiss from the tube. God, I love this guy so fucking much, man. Whoa. That has, like, a chewable texture to it. It's kind of thick. It's not like baby food. This is a thicker puree. And it tastes just like apple pie. I mean... That is crazy. And it's caffeinated, wow. too. <laughs> yeah, he's jacked. Steve Heart is always jacked. And sweet. I mean, it tastes like it has, like, actual crust and everything in there. It's what? It's not just, like, apples with some kind of thickener. Nice undertone of cinnamon. Look at that. Check this out. Steve also just doesn't age, either. Yeah, look, it has, like, granules in it. I wonder if it is like there are 19 different menu options. He pureed crust and stuff. Let's get a good look at this. And nine main courses or entrees. Five fruits <laughs> and then five desserts. This is a great camera angle. I mean it looks fine. It just I would eat this. I would I would definitely it try this. Difficult it doesn't look bad. To get out of the tube. Like if you were only using one hand take a while These that's like baby food yeah 12 hour flight missions and they end up eating one of these per hour on average oh Check shit their favorite menus find what agrees with their systems most eating All that the for 12 hours can't have anything spicy <clears throat> or 
It's difficult to squeeze out. I'll say that much. This is going to be a two-handed yeah, I guess job. You, you want the most like easily digestible food Seems for like long-haul trips picky. like that. A little bit fragile. Yeah, they can go number one up there. They can't go number two. They what? They have to have a very specific diet beforehand, mild foods, and be able to go. Wait, you can't poop for those 12 hours? What? Oh my god. Wait, what's 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 the reasoning behind that? Somebody said there's no toilets. Uh, what's what's the reasoning? Is it like a security issue? No toilets in the plane. How come they uh they don't put one in there? Is it just too small? Like it's just they just can't fit one in there, is that why? Small cockpit. Look up the cockpit. Yeah, I kinda wanna see this. Uh, no let, me, let me see the plane the real fast. Plane. I have I no repeat, idea what it looks like. No oh my god, you're sitting there for twelve hours. Oh I don't know why I was picturing picturing like a commercial plane, like you know, like where you could get up and walk around. That is actually hell. Oh my fucking god. Oh no beforehand and not up there. They cannot do it. You gotta hold Shit, it in. man. I didn't There's realize that it would be like actually designed to not aggravate or I didn't know much about you two planes before this, man. This is cool. So there's low risk of having to go up there. Fuck. Wait, so do you Except just have like a tube strapped to years. where you go pee pee? Pardon my French. Imagine there's a little bit of food waste. You might only be able to squeeze about 90% out. 90 to 95. <laughs> Seems to be a little You ate? What? <laughs> Oh, that's they even have a catheter. A small oh my god! Heat up the main courses. Is it really a catheter? So I might Jeez. go ahead and do that with the polenta with cheese and bacon. There's a chicken a la king, pasta bolognese. Most single seat aircrafts have piss bags strapped to the Piolet's leg. Bit. Oh, okay. No coffee, so they have to caffeinate a few of them. They have oh, a jazzy yeah, mac. so they don't fall asleep. That's what they call it: chocolate pudding. And then this. What the happens if you fall really asleep? Enjoy this stuff. I can see why, at least with this one. Let's get that last bit out. Oh, it's called a piddle pad. No oh, that's cool. From the caffeine. <clears throat> just over a standard you just die? cup of okay. coffee's worth. 100 milligrams. It's I guess that'll bad. keep you awake. Check that out. I think this actually looks pretty good. Like For what it does, sauce. the purpose it serves, I think this is fine. It's a thicker consistency and much thicker than baby food. And a lot more flavor. Get fucked, babies. You wouldn't be able to handle this shit. Fuck, babies, man. This. Mm. <clears throat> I'm telling you. I think I think it looks disgusting, but I guarantee it tastes good. It's a lot like, easier eating it like this. You know, you it's just like applesauce. Finish a tube of that, my guess, with one this hand. would make me the shit, though. 15 years of U2 spy planes, Caffeine uses, instantly makes me shit. Anything like this. They probably were having all sorts of accidents. Oh, you first think the texture would throw you off? August 1st, 1955. 1956, there were three fatalities. Three crashes. Oh, fuck. These things are not easy to fly. They have to stay alert, well-nourished, yeah, well-hydrated while they're up there. Let's check out the polenta with cheese and bacon next. They also this one I'm worried about. Hash browns with bacon. Bacon. This one stroganoff. just does not sound Peach good. Peach melba. Key lime pie. Like, <laughs> blended blended sweet stuff is generally usually, like, pretty good. You know, and, and any blended fruit, puree, stuff like that. But once you start blending savory stuff, I, I don't know if I could wrap my head around it. Here, I'm going to warm this up. Maybe. Hot water. Heating this up slowly but surely. On the plane, this isn't going to be heated, I though, right? I forgot to mention, these things have a three-year shelf life if stored at 80 degrees Fahrenheit. That meets the Department of Defense logistical supply chain requirements. We heated this up. Listen. Oh. It thins it out. It's much better. Warming oh. up all of the tubes. And again, they have a tube heater. Oh, they do have a tube heater. Up in their spy planes. Those things are really difficult to fly poor That's cool. visibility oh jesus man you know there are only about a hundred u2 spy plane pilots between the hundred of them only twenty-eight thousand of these things are produced a year oh, between those wow. 19 menus so they're really difficult to get this took me a while and were not easy to come by Good shit, Steve. 
Good fucking work, man. Proud of you, brother. Hmm. Savory? Hmm. Wow. You think he's gonna like it? This is even better than the apple pie. What? I almost feel like the apple pie should have been warmed up. I, I had that cold. What? But it also indicates that they're best heated up. I'm so curious now. Polenta with cheese and bacon. You hear it anywhere where it says pretty much the same consistency of baby food? That's incorrect. It's thicker than that. A prevalent cornmeal and bacon flavor. And it tastes like bacon with grits. Ah, you know what? Okay, that wouldn't it's be nice bad. Breakfast menu. Thick chunks of bacon. You can actually chew it. I thought it was going to be more like, just like a cheese spread, but if it has like grits in it, like a carb source like that, then I could see this being pretty decent. Wow. Tastes like American cheese. This one was tubed August well, space, 18th, space Air Force food is better than most other branches. It's almost three years old. Polenta is, is like corn grits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Easier once heated up. I don't think it'd be that bad, man. Yeah, it's just like eating grits with like a little bacon bits. Much empty. I that love. Do you guys fuck with grits? Much more efficient. It looks gross. Yeah, it definitely looks gross, but it's test approved. They actually enjoy it. I fucking love grits. They picked it. Look at that cornmeal. It's all stuff. Never had them. Pilots actually look forward to eating. Is, is, are grits? Are grits more of like a? Because I know they're a southern thing here in the U.S. But do, do like do the U.K. bros? Do you guys fuck with grits at all, or is it mostly like oatmeal for you guys? I'd say in America it's it's predominantly oatmeal, but like southern is like more grits. What the fuck is grits and Brit? Oh shit! So it's just not a, a European thing at all. Grits is only a U.S. thing. Oh. I guess I guess because we just produce so much corn, right? Isn't that what grits is? Just like dried up ground corn, essentially, like a porridge, like a a corn meal. Yeah, corn meal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it's called, corn meal. Grits is just yeah, it's corn oatmeal essentially. So instead of like using what wheat from the oats, uh, yeah, we just like ground up corn and turn it into oatmeal, like a porridge essentially, like a corn based porridge. I guess that it would be a U.S. thing because we, I mean, we just have corn. We have so much fucking corn. corn. Hub. <laughs> hey, thank you, Lexi. Thank you so much for 21 months. Great to see you back. Appreciate that, brother. <laughs> Damn, interesting. This looks like uh, this looks like Norwegian bacon OST or bacon cheese. It's spreadable cheese with bacon in it. It's super good. It comes with ham, chorizo, and even ch oh my god, that sounds amazing. I don't think this would be bad, man. Grits, grits are really Research good. Development and Engineering Center. They do a Fuck, great we have job no time. up some truly palatable. No, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, grits is a vehicle for other up, flavors. Exactly. It's easier to eat out of that tube than it is with a spoon. Wow. Precisely. It's a vessel for other flavors. Bacon. Mostly, it's like butter sometimes. Standard. Just buttered grits. Yeah, jazzy mac with cheese, the peach melba, caffeinated apple pie. There's also a caffeinated chocolate pudding. And, you know, one pilot was reported when he first ate his tube food. He didn't really know what he was doing. He had some chocolate pudding and it burst. He like mishandled it. What? This thing popped open. Look at this. Oh, God. Can Probably you imagine like that this one. inside of the YouTube plane? But yeah, he was covered in chocolate pudding. Look at that. <laughs> what a shame. It's not like USMRE or meal ready to eat individuals retort pouch tech. Those can be... Tossed around and folded, even that's a puncture. Oh no, this dent here. Can you not eat and that again, now? It proves how fragile these things are. It's not like a combat ration, per se. Gosh, it smells so savory. I mean, it's from 2021, it's almost an accentuated savory, right? And it's something you definitely don't want to consume. Fuck! I've decided I'm going to save it for display. I'm going to put it back in my freezer. No! Plus, if I have any bruises on the inside of my hand, it's great to grip on this. Just like that. It's worked wonders. Shit, man. Maybe I could do this. A little compromise. Let's check it out. Oh my god, it's like, Just it's fully little, open. Give it a little squeeze. Oh god, Steve. Oh god. God! Oh, that's so chunky. Oh! Yeah, it's not coming out. 
Well, that's as good as it gets. <laughs> it's too strong. Yeah, it's it's foul. Yeah, it's and not worth it. It's not worth it. I'm going to keep it in the tube. Throw it back in the freezer, We don't want Steve to die. See kind of. What yo, Sleepy, like? thank you so much for two My months. Apologies. Camilla, yo, welcome. What's up, bro? Brothers. Thanks for five, dude. Time. What it cost. Thank you so much, Camilla. How you been, bro? Or something. Hosted, great to see you back, man. Thanks for 13, use. brother. Acquire another ration if I empty it from the bottom. Thank you, mates. And keep the, the cylinder in shape. Someone Thanks for the shout out. For display. And look at this. Too bad. Fuck, man. This I, I really wanted to see this. 2022, which means I'm looking for more of these. This is just an introduction. Oh. Four day three at the left six nine. That's a good start. So this was U.S. Air Force in pilot. Dude, he's looking for more. So hopefully, hopefully he'll come by more. Tube food. What an experience. He anyway, has to get more, right? This is Steve, 1989. I He's gonna do it. The video. Well, anyway, spy Sorry. plane pilot tube. Get food. ready, guys. What an experience. He's gonna do well, it. Anyway, this is Steve, 1989. I hope you liked the video, and I'll be coming back at you with something new. Or old. old. All right. Cool. Cool. See ya. Thank you, Steve. Thank you for another banger, man. For another fucking banger. That one was cool. That was a short one, but it was it's really interesting to see. Uh, and big shout out to the veterans, man. Big shout out to the vets out there, man. Love you guys. Thanks for everything. Love you guys. Keep on fighting for everything, man. We love you guys. Uh, cool. We've got one more Steve that he uploaded on the same day. This is going to be a longer one. The 2004 oh, Country seven. Captain Chicken MRE. Yet another one of the worst meal ready to eat testing taste review what if it doesn't have coffee instant type 2 maybe that's the reason he doesn't like it maybe everything else is good but there's just no coffee instant type 2 and he just shits on it yet another one of the worst us MREs ever made alas i still find it somewhat enjoyable that is just so classic steve boys you guys ready oh that soundscape oh the pixelated pictures Oh. This is the infamous USMRE or meal ready to eat individuals country captain. What is country chicken, captain chicken? Number four in service from the year 2000 to 2004. I never heard of that. Country captain chicken ended up getting replaced with the cheese and veggie omelet, which that was in service from 2005 up to 2008. Actually, there were a couple that. We're still in production up till March 2009, but nobody ever wants to remember that. <laughs> it's like insider MRE humor. <laughs> curry dish that originally came out of the Indian subcontinent. I'm so sad because I know what he's talking about. <laughs> and made its way to American trays through Savannah, Georgia, Charleston, South Carolina, and New York. It was also General George S. Patton's favorite dinner. Such a Steve head. A look. Oh, I'm excited for this one. Country Captain Chicken. Okay, so we're off the bat. Here's the main course. In that old cardboard box. That Classic. took up extra weight and space. The USMRE used to be a lot more bulky because of these. They stopped doing that around 2014. It's the first year they made them more compact. Country Captain What's the yield? 260, 18 grams of protein, 20 grams of carbs, 11 fat. Captain Chicken. That's crazy. Breaded chicken patty and curry flavored sauce. Oh. 18 grams of protein. Chicken. Not too many carbs. Yeah, it's really low carb. Flameless ration heater. Oh, wait, what was the sodium? 18 grams. Where is it? Whoa! <laughs> grams of protein. Not too many carbs. Yikes. Flameless ration heater. <laughs> Holy shit. Standard crackers. Oh, wow. Milk chocolate M&Ms. Let's we'll see if those are still any good. Here's your accessory packet. Let's check this out. I'm going to say it. I think milk chocolate M&Ms are a waste of space, man. Unless they have a nut inside of them, I, I do not care about M&Ms. Oh. Hmm. Peanut M&M's are so good. Tabasco sauce. It still has good color to it. That's a great sign right there. 
Not they're just so boring compared to peanut. Out. Like once they made peanut M and M's, I just you know, it's just like what's what's the point? It's twenty years old. It's a two thousand four. There's your chewing gum. Let's get the rest out. Pretzel M and M's are good too. Matches. Yes. Taster's choice. It feels like it might still be good. Who knows? <gasps> no coffee type two. Yeah, Taster's Red choice. Taster's choice pack. I'm telling you, those are usually fouled up with recrystallized caffeine that's actually what it is it's not dry mold creamer non-dairy dry Cho yeah this is 19 years old 2004 toilet paper moist towel this is pretty old four grams Base of sugar so he need a nut inside him <laughs> i i saw also four grams <laughs> i didn't mean it like that i meant peanut toaster pastry you ever pee on your that nut? is an apple toaster pastry oh man these are Amazing. They're kind of rare. Peanut butter. Classic 19 year old peanut butter. Which sometimes these things can leak. And it feels like it's well emulsified already. Like you don't even need to knead the packaging. Oh. Mashed potatoes? Mashed potatoes in a retort pouch. Oh. Russet potatoes. Look at that. Oh, yeah. 120 calories, only 15 grams of carbs. That's crazy. What is it? It's what? like, is it mostly water? Yes, it is. It's mo first ingredients water. Yeah, mostly water. Look at that. Not bad. All right. Let's get oh, the I have a bad tray. feeling about this nice. one. Okay, let's first start oh, off shit. by bad. All right, let's get the sat on your tray. Nice. Okay, let's first start off by sorry heating up that main. Oh boy. Chat, wow. I do not feel good about this. There's a pretty solid piece uh, of meat in there. A bunch of sauce. Here, let's squish it all down to the bottom. Uh, that heating element will actually do its thing. There we go. Looks good. No punctures, no swelling. And the mashed potatoes. Nutrition, a force multiplier. Yeah, they really make you eat everything just so you can get all your nutrition. If you don't get eat mm. the crackers, the dairy shakes, and the snack bread, you're not getting your calcium. Oh. Stuff like that. You have to eat the fruit to get the vitamin C. It ensures that you eat the entire ration and get That's the actually very satisfying to look at. Need. Not cutting any corners. This thing also looks good. Let's mash it's like up. a crossword puzzle yeah, for yeah. nutrients. All right. Let's see how this FRH performs. What we're gonna do is set this on the back, this on the front, set it back in this box. Let's activate it, or at least attempt to. I do not feel good about this, guys. That looks good. Who do you oh, think I have smaller hands, good. Steve or Hazel? <laughs> hey, Steve has like beautiful hands. So do I. Exothermic reaction. We love, we love our beautiful dainty hands. It's not bad. Even if it's just like half heated, it's amazing. It's time for some coffee. You think Steve will do the hand thing? Why is his hand so vascular? He's just oh, jacked. Man. He's like insanely yeah. jacked. He just knows yeah. a lot about nutrition. Like he's he's very smart <clears throat> when it comes to like nutrition-based things. So once in a blue moon, he probably nice just works out too. Dried crystals. Am I gonna try the MRE I got? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we've done one MRE stream before, but I'd be down to try the other ones, of course. That was a really fun stream when we did that. Yeah, Steve is smart when he's eating probably normal food. Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on. Oh. Okay. I wonder if the M&Ms will be kind of sour or if they'll be okay. I'm guessing the M&Ms. Oh, 
Oh. Okay. I wonder if the M&Ms will be kind of sour or if they'll be okay. I'm guessing they're going to be fine. Oh. Mm, they have that slight kind of turn, you know. Now they're just fine. It's probably the food coloring. Let's see them. 19 year old M&Ms. That is crazy. Is a little straggler. You don't want to get out of there. Usually cho chocolate's light. pretty okay, right? Look at that. It'll oxidize. The one that's kind of bloomed. There's no big deal. Yeah, even if it blooms or oxidizes, it's fine, these right? These things last. Usually. No oh, hiss. This one is. Something might be perfect in a MRE of this age and something else. Not so much. And it's sometimes just sheer luck. I mean, really. In this case. Oh, mm -hmm. That's aroma therapy. Ethan Here. about to turn all the random sounds from a Steve M R Evig into the beats of a new song. Kek. We Here. need to do that at some point. Very inviting apple cinnamon. That's not a bad smell, idea. Like almost kind of seasonal. Thank you, Need. Leave this thing. Thanks for the bits, man. That's not a bad idea. It's really not. It's perfect. Oh. Shell stable art. Look at that. Oh. Cinnamon. Oh. Time to check out those crackers. Come on, give me a hiss. Come on. Oh! Nice hiss. Oh! Dude, that's the best one we've had in a while. Nice hiss. That was like a perfect nice hiss. Vacuum seal. And these hiss. Those early 2000s nice hiss. Late 90s, early 2000s era MRE crackers. Oh. There. Oh, yeah. You can smell that malted barley. It is... Nice hits. Yeah, yeah, it's... Nice hits. <laughs> well, except for That's the salted ones sense. from back in the day. They were so well baked. Nice hits. But this, <laughs> definitely some runner up Ooh. MRE crackers. They're a little crumbly, though. Are these the ones with shortening in them? I can't remember when they yeah, stopped doing that. Too much of a baked appearance. And they're a bit easy to break. But who knows? Actually, look at that on the back. There's some. What? Baked. Look, look at that. That's that's What nice. is that, Steve? We're going to have to lay down a perimeter. Oh, he's going to eat around it? Peanut butter. Around those crackers. <laughs> no oh, heavens. <laughs> This great flavor, a nice roasted peanut flavor. Fuck yeah. It even has a little bit of a chew because it's so emulsified. Mm. That's some of the best MRE peanut butter I've ever had. <clears throat> All right, here, let's check out an MM. &M. All right, let's go for a blue one. MMs. Been in military rations since World War II. Oh, yeah, that's right. Man. Let's bite in. Hmm. It's an old ass candy. That's what's going on. It's a little bit bloomed. See that? Oh, yeah. Mm. The shellac held that slightly bloomed milk chocolate in, and they're starting to break. Oh, that's why M and M's were invented. Oh, one. really? Next thing you know. The oh, so they would. Okay, we need like to get melt? Seth cooking on the idea to reach out to Steve and have him come over for a stream where he oh, and Ethel try my MREs God. together. Bro, you have no idea. I would take a Steve collab over literally anybody, man. Like that would be my dream collab. Like without a doubt, one hundred percent. I mean, this, that would be a dream come true, man. Just to chill and just try some crazy like international, international uh, MREs with Steve. Even your girlfriend? No, Nyan would understand, bro. You know what I mean? Even low tier God. If I if I lose Diamond, let's I'll, I'll put it this way, buddy. If I lose Diamond in Rocket League, I'm gonna collab with low tier God. Okay, if you know what I mean. Over Canute. <laughs> I don't really like VTubers. Hey, great to meet you, Canute. Even Dark Side Phil. Oh, I think that's Nyan's. So like. Yeah, hers, hers would be DSP, mine would be uh, Steve, Emery. We'll start the bloat. Steve is my hall pass. <laughs> yeah, Steve's choice. my hall pass, man. Survived all that time. No, my account didn't get banned. It, it just logged me out when I was trying to comment for some reason. More so than usual flavor. I don't know if that's just because it's, I don't know, it's, it's red taster's choice for you, but it tastes like diner coffee that's been sitting on the pot. Better than mm. nothing, especially since they don't give you any other beverages in this thing, which is kind of cruel and unusual. Oh, yeah, no, no peanut butter and crackers, beverages. And 
Boy, I hope you got some extra water. This one's focusing its caloric content on food value. This thing's kind of like your dinner. You'd probably have your coffee. Your Wubby? Oh, yeah. Wubby collab would be awesome. I wonder if this is heating up. That I would love to do it's anything warm. with Wubby. I'm a big fan. Minute. Steve M R E collab and Steve M R E boys talk about yeah, to the goals of yours. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Be Even though these things wait. Bro, trust me, I, I would love to. I, I think Steve's down in Florida though, right? I think Probably he's down a little like far away. Seven grams or something like that. I'd go to Florida for it. Maybe I could do something with Charles. Not brown. They look just like how I remember them. I we think he's Florida, right? Mashed. The smell. A little weird, actually. Oh, he is geez. the Florida guy. No wonder he eats this stuff. Yeah, Florida man eats a hundred year old MRE. <laughs> what about Steph Curry? I I would rather collab with Steve MRE than Steph Curry. And I love basketball. I love Steph Curry. But I would I if if I had to choose like a like a one of one situation, I would take Steve, man. I honestly don't know who I would choose over Steve. Steve would Steve has been my favorite YouTuber for God, since like 2016, I'd take Steve over just about anyone, man. Snoop Dogg. Okay, now that's getting, that's cruel. That's a cruel, that's hard. Mr. Beast. I, I would, I would take Steve, man. I'm not even going to lie. Be in a Mr. Beast video or do something with Steve Emery. I would take Steve Emery. I love, don't get me wrong. I love my boy, Jimmy. I love my boy, Jimmy. But Steve is just, I mean, he just has such a special place in my heart, man. Tectone? I don't know who that is. Rivers Cuomo. Oh, I just did something with him a few weeks ago. Yeah, we did an IRL stream. Fuck, Mary kill. Steve, MRE, Tony the Tiger, and Spider-Man. Uh, I would marry Steve. I would kill Tony, and I would fuck the shit out of Spider-Man. Why would you kill Tony? Because animals don't talk. That's why they need to know their place. Spider-Man will fuck you, not going to lie. He's not the only one that shoots webs. I'll say that much. I'd kill a... T what the fuck? <laughs> Rose? Rose, you're like the sweetest person in here. How can... Rose, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'd rather kill a tiger than... Oh, oh my God. I, oh, d dude, I read this as I want to kill a tiger, then fuck it. What is, oh, never mind, Rose. Okay. <laughs> I was like, yo, you're the, like the sweetest person here. <laughs> Butter and foul, like sour milk. <laughs> it's my dyslexia, man. I get a pass. I get a pass. That smells good. It smells like... I was like, what the fuck? Tim Curry. Oh, wow. That actually is... <laughs> smells like... Tim Curry. Oh, wow. That actually is... What is like happening? <laughs> Tim Curry. Oh, wow. Did he that... say Tim Curry? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> he got so zesty here, man. <laughs> what the fuck? Good. It smells like... Tim Curry. Oh, wow. That actually is... Is that a raisin at the top there? That's yeah. <laughs> Tim Curry. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh, wow. I bet that retour pouch feels. I bet that retour pouch feels much oh, wow. better after getting that out of there. Oh, wow. I'm not sure if we'll need the Tabasco sauce or not. I'm going to set that off to the side. I bet that. Ooh, oh wow, 17 months, chicken. nice. Oh, that nice. looks so bad. Cutting, looking there. Oh. Processed and reformed 
Dirty Dude, I don't think it's worth it, sauce, Steve. I don't know if it's worth it, man. Steve just dumped out some serious stinky doo-doo looking shit. That is so fucking nasty, my god. Dude. You know what he said in the title card? He said that, it, that he still liked it somewhat, so there might be a saving grace here. I don't know. I, I don't even know if this was good in 2004. Hey, Blarg, thank you so much for 17, man. Welcome back, bro. What's the shirt? Oh, my God. That shirt goes so hard. The price is right. Fine. No off odors of any kind. Is that the Joker? Oh, dude, that shirt goes so hard. Just as I remember it. For better or worse here. Hmm. Yes, Steve that is so like fun. That looks comes out of the other That's end when dark. you're done with it. It's disgusting. Nothing like Tim Curry. That is, like, hey, he's a good-looking guy, man. That's just the bonus, you know. He's just a jacked, oh, good-looking guy. Who's this? Just a chill. That is, hmm. It's like a cheap tomato sauce and curry flavor with a dry, processed and reformed chicken patty with some breading that doesn't really hold on. Mm. Barely even notice it. It's just. Oh. Is it like a weird kind of mushy outer texture and you bite in yeah. to this somewhat questionable rubber tire of a textured... He looks like a smaller Triple H. Yeah, maybe Double H or something like that. And dry chicken. I can see that. It's very understandable as to why... Singular H. Phased out. They just call him H. If you were eating it cold or if you just didn't like curry, this would be highly demoralizing. If you like curry and you could heat it up that's a little bit sweet. Probably the raisins. But yeah, if you were into curry, it'd be great. Menu four for eight years was a cruel joke to the soldiers. You had this, which just got ten times worse with the veggie omelet. But it's not also he's saying the, the veggie omelet is worse than this. Look, look at that raisin. Oh, raisins in it too? What the fuck? What were they thinking with this? I don't know about I like I like raisins. I know raisins get a bad rap, but oh fuck, that is just a foul idea. Authentic. Hmm. We'll see it held up. Hmm. Oh. Oh yeah. I've I I well I you know what I've never had raisins in curry so maybe I shouldn't speak too soon. I bet it could be good. I bet it could be good. I guess I'm just picturing the curry that I've had in my life before and then putting raisins into that just doesn't mix. But I'm I'm sure it's spiced appropriately. I don't know. Virgo, thank you so much for the bits, by the way. YouTube Vader, thank you so much, guys. A little dry on its own. Oh, the classic. Crumble the crack. Yeah, classic. That's classic. Put blue m on the end and maybe save the rest for display. I wonder how, like, I'm so curious, and I wonder if he'll ever do, like, a tour of his house because he saves so much for display like even his shelves have evolved so much over the years i wonder what the actual like display in his house looks like because he's saved so much there we go it kind of tastes like a chocolate peanut butter crunch bar of some kind like a makeshift candy bar really hmm I don't know, Steve. 
Yeah, he should just have his own museum at oh, this point. Yeah. There you go. That's another thing you can do. If you want another weird food video, I put someone okay, eating canned chicken in a dungeon talk. dive. Does oh, this shit. dude oil yeah. himself up before he films himself? Cause his arms and face are very shiny for some reason. He, well, he's from Florida, man, so that's just a uh, mosquito repellent. That's bug spray, brother. Butter. That's like, uh, that's, that's cologne in Florida. Is your friend. Humidity and bug spray. Mm-hmm. Get them no damn skeeters at the house. flavors or anything. <laughs> spray some on before a date, man. You know what? You spray some on before a date and hope to God your date isn't a mosquito. You know what I mean? Check out that pop turn. That you would be awkward. Two of these in older 2002, 2003. You just like get to the date and you're like, oh my God, I was so worried you'd be a mosquito. Oh my God. Maybe even up to O. Oh my fucking God. Five humanitarian oh, daily God. rations. <laughs> you get on the you get on the phone with them. Hey, hold. so uh, how was your day? <laughs> You're so funny. They <laughs> just walk into oncoming traffic because there's wow. like headlights coming. <laughs> Only a slight recrystallization of sugar. That's phenomenal. Perfect flavor. It hasn't changed in all this time. <laughs> Sucky dry, I'll tell you that much though. It's Apple not all bad flavor. dating a mosquito. Suck you right off. First date too. Like First date. It's really dry, even though it's dry. Um, I've never met a mosquito that didn't try to suck me off. You just save the corners for later to smell them. Yep. Me and a few other. Van Gang in Baldur's Gate? <laughs> that would be hilarious. <laughs> Just convince Connor to fuck a bear. Save it and then sell it. Like later, it's a great investment. Oh, I think the toaster title too. Yeah, apple toaster pastries. Which sometimes they'll say toaster pastry apple, other times they'll just say toaster pastry. Anyway. Thank you, brother. All out of beverage. Oh well, that pairs very well with the coffee. I mean, flavor-wise, they go hand in hand. G Shonen? Wait, what? What would These G Shonen be? Like gold. Grim, I've heard of people doing Shonen? strange things for him. Here, I got water off to the side. I'm gonna need it. This toaster pastry is a little dry. Steve is kind of hot. Steve is a Jeez. Steve is a good looking guy. What should I do? Guys Shonen, aka okay, guys, guys. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh Look no, this. man. And this is just a tad bit exotic, gourmet, oh. in all the wrong ways. Gay Shonen. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Steve, That's you are a sick fuck. Really? Oh, wow. 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 Some good old palate cleansing. Chewing gum. Oh, Jesus, man. It reforms. Oh, has real sugar Jesus. and a great chew. A little bit firm at first, but it does not turn to brittle. And it reforms into a nice, not overly soft, and most certainly not too firm piece of chewing gum. With a nice, not overly strong, subtle peppermint flavor. Country Captain Chicken. It didn't rate well with the troops. Oh, Jesus. It phased man. out after four years, and it is a thing of the past. What an experience. Well, anyway... This is Steve1989. I hope you liked the video. Yes. And I'll be coming back at you with something new. Thank you, You're Steve. You're old. All right, cool. See ya. Thank you, Steve. Ah. How'd we get so lucky, guys? To live in the same world as this guy. <laughs>